Hey YouTube, today I'm just going to be showing you how to jailbreak any iPhone 4, 3GS or iPad Touch 3rd or 4th generation on iOS 5. This is a tether jailbreak and will work on any A4 chip device. This also works on the first iPad. I just restored my iPhone 4 to factory settings so and this is going to be a step by step uh, process for you guys here. Connect to my Wi Fi. Okay. Set up as a new iPhone. Uh, skip this step. Skip. Agree. Agree. Don't send. Start using iPhone. Right, okay guys. You can see I'm all set up. Uh, my phone's all fresh and ready. And um, what we're going to do is you're going to make sure it's connected to your computer. And see, it says, congratulations, your iPhone has been unlocked, whatever. Blah, blah, blah. And then you're going to need two files. Uh, one's going to be Red Snow, and the other's going to be the selected IPSW, which is basically the software your phone runs on. And both these links will be in the description. So um, once your iPhone is connected by a USB to your computer and on on an iOS 5, you're going to open Red Snow and what we're going to do is go on everything else and we're going to go on select IPSW and select the one we need and just be saying the build was identified used for the rest of the Red, no Red Snow se session excuse me and then we're going to go back and press jailbreak it's going to provide jailbreak data, blah blah blah. Alright, all we're going to do is have install Cydia selected. And now you need to get your iPhone. And what you're going to need to do is, once it's on, hold down a po home and power button for 10 seconds. Until the device turns off. And once you hear that noise, let go of the power button, but keep holding the home button. So you hear another noise. Now your device is in DFU mode and ready to be jailbroken. So I'm not going to skip any of this video and I'm just going to go right through it and show you guys how to jailbreak your iPhone 4s or 3GS or iPad or whatever on iOS 5. Once install CD is ticked and your device is in DFU mode and off obviously, I can see, um, what you're going to do is, you're going to click next and it'll bypass the screen and it'll start jailbreaking it. This is all normal, it's just doing what it needs to do.
I'm doing this in, all in real time. Just so you guys get an idea of how long it takes. Alright, and it says the rest of the uh, process takes place on the device, and you'll see the device rebooting. So, all we're going to do is on the computer, we're just going to press the X button, and Red Snow's just going to be ready. Don't, don't close Red Snow yet because we've not finished the jailbreak. Just going to wait for iPhone to reboot. Alright, now we're going to go across the page and as you can see, the city has a white icon. So uh, the jailbreak's not done yet, what we're going to do now, see if the crashes. As I said this is to have a jailbreak so we're going to have to run it tethered uh, through red snow. And every time your device turns off or you decide to switch it off, it runs out of battery. You're going to have to connect your iPhone to the computer or Mac and open Red Snow and this is the process you're going to have to do. Extras, excuse me, double click there, um, select IPSW and then it's the same one oh, and you're going to press just boot. Right, now we're going to put our device into the FU mode like we did before. So. Very simple, easy process like before. All we're going to do is hold power and home 10 seconds. And then keep holding the home button. Right, and it will start doing tethered process And you should see a pineapple come onto your iPhone screen. And it has done. The rest of the process takes place in your device. So now we're completely finished with Red Snow, so we just press the X. And all we care about now is the iPhone. Alright, slide to unlock. Now, see, CD has an icon and it actually opens. User. And then I'll just show you there. iPhone 4 GSM. Cydia and then it's iOS 5. Thanks for watching guys, hope that helped. Don't forget to run it tethered once you've jailbroken the phone through Red Snow, otherwise you won't be jailbroken properly. Watch my other videos on how to get free apps such as TomTom Tom and the rest. Thanks for watching, uh, any questions just ask me. You can see it took me around about 10 minutes to, for the actual jailbreak process. 
Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye.